Hi everyone and welcome to the second part of chapter 5. In this part, we will learn to read data with Sony's platter. A proximity sensor detects the presence or absence of objects using the reflection of infrared light without physical contact. They are used in various applications, such as touchless switches in public restrooms and smartphones. In this activity, we will move our hands up and down above the proximity sensor. The proximity sensor will continuously read and print the proximity values to the shell console. The closer the obstacle to the sensor, the greater the proximity value. The code will continuously update and display the proximity value at an interval of 0.1 second. To start, we need first to enable the plotter function in Sony IDE to have a better visual on the proximity value. Now, we are ready to write the code for this activity. Line 4 to 5 initializes the I2C communication bus for the APDS sensor for the user to interact with it. The configuration is similar to when using the gesture and color sensor. Line 6 enables the proximity feature of the APDS sensor. It allows the sensor to detect objects or the proximity of objects in front of it. Line 9 reads the proximity value from the APDS sensor and assigns it to the proximity variable. The proximity value represents how close an object is to the sensor. The closer the object, the greater the value. Line 10 prints the current proximity value along with the string proximity text to the shell console, allowing you to monitor and see the proximity values as it changes. Let's run the code and try this program together. Let's turn this activity into an obstacle detection beeping device. First, import simple I.O. library so that we can initialize the buzzer's pen GP21. To do this activity, you will need first to import simple I.O. library, then modify the code inside while loop so it looks like this. Let's run the program and see the result. The APDS proximity sensor works by emitting and detecting infrared light to determine the distance of an object or obstacle. The sensor includes an IR photodiode that is placed adjacent to the IR LED. Active IR sensors consist of an IR LED that emits infrared light when powered on. The IR photodetector, usually known as photodiode or a phototransistor, is placed adjacent to the IR LED. It's sensitive to the same infrared light that the IR LED emits. The intensity of the reflected infrared light is used to determine the proximity of the object. Well done completing part 2 of chapter 5. In the next video, we will build an automated waste bin. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.